Hey guys, it's Najam. In this video, I'm going to show you the equivalent of nitrogen but for Wayland. And I'm using Hyperland over here. It also works on Sway. And in the configuration file, I've just mapped it to keys that will allow me to change the wallpaper. This is called Waypaper. It works just like nitrogen, as you can see. It's got a user interface. And it's available in the AURs. So you can use pipx to install it. And let's go ahead and open up Wofi and we'll write in Waypaper and it will just come up. Now I have a lot of wallpapers, so it's just gonna cache them in. But as you can see, it just it looks very much like nitrogen. And it uses different backends to change the wallpaper. I've got two installed right now. I use Sway BG, which works for me. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and exit this because you don't really need to open this uh, unless you want more of a GUI user interface. Um, Instead, I'm going to go ahead and open up the folder and I'm going to go into the configuration file. So in the config directory, you can write a way paper. And in here you have the configuration.ini. And if you go ahead and open this, this is what the configuration looks like. Now, if you want to copy my configuration and have the wallpapers that I use for my, that I use in my wallpaper collection, Go ahead and check out the uh, description. I'll leave a link to my repository and then you can go ahead and just clone this config file. I don't think it came with a configuration file. I just copied this from the internet. Um, and also, so all over here, you just need to change. I'm just waiting for that to cache and then close on its own because I've got loads of wallpapers. Um, so over here, you can, you need to put in the folder to your own directory. And um, also you can, and then you can just leave it as it is. And then you can just use fill in the uh, settings over here instead of using it on the GUI. Let's go ahead and exit out of that and we'll go into Hyperland and I'll show you the configuration on here and I'll show you where I've binded it. So when you start up Hyperland, uh, you're going to want to run this command Waypaper Restore Random and this will put up a random wallpaper every time you boot into Hyperland. And also if you go up, you'll find over here the bind so i've got it to bound to um, the mod key as well as w it will execute this command which is way paper restore and random which is the same command and so it's very simple you just put in this command and if you want to run it through the um, terminal you can run the same thing so you can just ex ex uh, execute this command and it, what it'll do is it'll just put and up a different random wallpaper and i'm just going to go ahead and do that right now so i'll press the bind key and it will change to a different wallpaper and so this is really, really cool. Uh, this is pretty much what I was looking for. The only thing I could ask, ask for is a timed uh, setting over here that it would change automatically the wallpapers. Um, but I like this. It's actually pretty nice. So it's a very simple software. It works. And um, uh, this is what I've been using to change wallpapers. And it just keeps the desktop looking fresh and feeling fresh. So um, yeah, check out the link in the description to my repos. So it's very easy to install and it works and it's really, really nice. Um, if you guys have any questions, ask me in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching and um, I'll see you guys in another video.